All right, guys, so we're here at the uh, failed planned community of Silverado. Um, I'm not sure what the name of the town is here in Arizona, but I've been seeing this all over the place. You know, YouTube, Instagram, all kinds of places. Just, uh, I'm, fine. I'm glad we're finally out here, that's for sure. And it stopped raining. It, it's freezing, guys. When we pulled up, it was 39 degrees. It, it, when the uh, the sun comes out, it feels great. For a second. Yeah, for, for the second that it, it does decide to come out. Yeah. The Vail Plant community of Silverado would have been a shiny new community for Arizona just outside of Kingman. The 5,000 acre site would have had around 113 luxury homes standing on their own two and a half acre plot. The plant community would have included parks with barbecue grills and an 18 hole golf course. There were also neighborhood communities planned with an additional 12,000 homes, schools, a fire station and shops. In 2008, the housing market crashed and so did the plans for Silverado. Now here we are over 15 years later and the community is slowly returning to the desert. Now all that's left are these models for the homes that would have dotted the community of Silverado. So join me as we explore the community that the desert is slowly reclaiming and find out what's left. Spiders? Yeah. I don't know. Wow. These are, uh, wow, that's pretty bad. Who would take their time to, uh, come and sweep all the dirt into one room out here? Oh, no. I think that was just Winston. Yeah. There's a pantry? All right. Yep, and it is a little bit windy. <laughs> a little drafty, I should say. Man, these would would have been nice homes. I wonder what uh what caused this place to fail. You know, I'll have to do some research and uh put it down in the description. I'm guessing that would have been a fireplace right there. Right there in the uh, center of the screen. Master bedroom. Yeah, this would have been really nice. Bedroom. Oh, a jacuzzi tub that uh, looks like it was never installed. <laughs> uh, oh, bee's nest. I bet if it was during the summertime, bees would be crazy here. That would be, that's cool. Yep. All right, let's go, uh, let's go check out another house, guys. It, it is freezing here. So we're going to try to kind of blow through these. So uh, we'll see you guys at probably that house next. Man, that sun feels good. Yeah. It's a three-car garage. Yeah, this is a really nice size garage though. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. yeah, there's been some cows in here too. <laughs> I don't know. Yep. This is a small room. Oh, this might be That's your eyes. Yeah, this has got some high ceilings in here. I guess that will be a fire. A fire? Oh yeah, 
A fireplace. Looks like somebody's been in here with a shotgun. Yeah. 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 Check it out, guys. Somebody's been here with a shotgun. See all the tiny little holes, and then the wad just goes right through. Man, these would have been really nice houses. Maybe a nice uh, formal dining room. <laughs> These kids are over here acting like we're shopping for our house. Uh, I'm pretty sure this would have been the kitchen. Yeah. Would have been, huh? Yeah, the island was right there. Uh huh. No, we could see it. We could see it. Yeah, the drains. Mm hmm. So uh, let's move this way. Just a closet. Some more rooms. Yeah. I think this was a, a master bedroom. Oh, adjoining bathrooms. Wow, that's a heck of a window for a bathroom. Yeah, adjoining uh, bedrooms by a bathroom. Brady Bunch bathrooms. Let's uh, let's try to stay in here. Let's cut through and go check the other side out. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we did. I guess we already checked this out. I don't think I checked this room out. Yeah, so this would have been master bedroom. This would be yours. Decent size uh, walk-in closet. This would be yours and mom's closet. Yeah. <laughs> We're not in the market for a house, baby. No, no, no. I don't know. Um, bathtub. I'm guessing bathtub. Oh! Yeah, it would have been shower. This is definitely a shower. This would have been the, uh, the toilet. Um, Let's see. Yeah, that's a... I can't tell. Yeah, that probably would have been. Because there's a, a drain right there. They never leveled it down to the ground, though. Mm -hmm. They got really close to finishing these houses. Mm -hmm. They must have just ran out of money. Oh, look at bee's nest right there. Yeah. All right, so we're, we're not going to stay here too long. Okay. It's cold, otherwise they'd be going crazy That's in here. Cool. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, so we're just going to blow through these things real quick. Wow, this is really nice. Would have been really nice. Oh, I actually love this. Yeah, it's, it's nice, huh? I like the backyard. Well, what, you know, the covering. Yeah. How much? It's blue over here doing something. Yeah. Pretty cool. <laughs> and this would have been the master. Sorry guys, I am kind of blowing through this a little bit. It's cold, we still got a long drive ahead of us. Yeah. That's too bad. <laughs> I think that's uh, just another room. Nice size office, maybe. Yeah. This will um, be a, a closet. That would be a closet. I like the back. Yeah, I know. I like that too. That probably would have been a paid upgrade, though. Come on, Blue. Come on. Oh, it's a blue Yeah, we didn't do that one. And just another bedroom. Watch 
Watch out for rats. Obviously, they're here. Pantry. Yeah. Well, this uh, builder really likes to uh, connect bedrooms by a bathroom. No, that wouldn't have been a, a window. That's a window with a heck of a view. Okay. All right, guys, we're going to go check out one, maybe two more houses, and then we're out of here. Okay, I want to say this is P's first explore. What do you think? Yeah. Is this P's first explore? Yeah. Like this? Mm -hmm. I think it is her first explore like this. Wow. You know what guys, there's no graffiti here whatsoever, but they're vandalized to hell. Check that out. And let me, I'm gonna widen this out. Yeah, these things are uh. Fireplace, fireplace, huh. fireplace. Yep, that's a fireplace, we'll check that out in a minute. This uh, this one's a little bit smaller than the others. The bedrooms were a lot bigger than the other houses. <laughs> yeah, this was probably a a bathroom. I'm surprised it's not connected. And another really small bedroom. These are probably about ten feet by ten feet, not including the uh, closet. And uh, a lot smaller kitchen area. I don't like how these new houses. Look at her. Um, oh yeah, fireplace. I don't like how these new houses have the kitchen and the living room together. I don't know. To me, it's just kind of. There's mold in there? Okay, so we'll uh, tread lightly. I don't know where she sees the mold. <coughs> oh yeah, there it is. Black mold. And then the, uh, yeah. I guess this was the master bedroom. <coughs> Tub right there. Yeah, I think so too, P. <laughs> I'm guessing this would have been a laundry room. Okay. Oh, and the garage. So yeah, you know what? This was a pretty small, smaller of the two. Or the smaller of, I don't even know what I'm even trying to say, but I think this was the smallest house out of all the houses here. You know, just since we're right here, we might as well just check this one out. And another three car garage. Oh, look. It's a big bee's nest right there. See that? Oh, no, that's not a bee's nest. It's like a those mud daubers or something. Yeah, the cows must come in here to get away out of the wind. When we pulled up, there was a really big bull. Standing on the side of the road, maybe about a eighth of a mile up the road there. There's a lot of poop in here, Is there? Like rat poop. Yeah, it's well ventilated. I'm not too worried about it. Oh, wait, I bet she's going to ask that side. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lot bigger than the other one. I don't know. Yeah, well, these were just supposed to be the models. Like the cow came home. Huh? At the front door. Yeah, I know, I've seen that. These were just supposed to be models. So, that was like a formal dining room, kitchen, living room, fireplace again. Is this the master, Holly? No, we didn't. Sure? No, Positive. Yeah. Here goes the uh, the shower. Oh, kind of yeah. like how the showers are hidden in some of these. 
don't? No, I do. Oh, oh this is not a shower, kid. Look at it. Oh, it would have been a shower. Oh man, no sunglasses on, I feel weird. Alright guys, that's going to do it for this episode. The plant community of Silverado. I guess this would be the town of Silverado, I'm not sure. But uh, it's a cool little spot. You know, I wouldn't drive you know, all the way from another state just to come and see this. If you guys want to come and see this, plan through. to see other things. Oh yeah, if you're like passing through like we are came to see some family but uh yeah if you're passing through it's a cool spot to stop and check out uh you could spend a little while here and get some cool pictures and whatnot but that's gonna do it guys thank you for everybody that's out here supporting us sooner john nikki in florida and david piotrowski so thank you guys so much for supporting us during this travel time and you know everybody else that, that had donated before Michelle Sterling uh, you know the list just goes on guys the list is at the beginning of the video so thank you guys so much I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video bartender Coors Light please